first, I can only hold one tape. Yeah, Dave. Yeah. Oh my God, John Tron's no nuts and bolts video. I die. It's so funny. It's so f accurate. It's so accurate to how I feel about that game. Oh man. Okay. I thought we were gonna watch something. Side of the Matheson Farm. Yeah, so we can uh, go turn up, guys. Oh, yeah, this was actually the picture from the photograph, I believe, that we found earlier. Boom, boom. Boom, 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 boom. You don't have a flashlight. No flashlight. Rose, we're going into the cellar tonight for another game of hide and seek. Father won't return from his errand to Red Deer until the morning. And Norm says he's found a lantern so he can take us there after dark. If we all meet by the chapel after tonight's dinner. I know you hate the rancid smell of petrol down there, but it'll be fun, I promise. Maggie. I don't know why Maggie has a man's voice. Don't tell Patty. She'll tell on us. Oh my. Oh man, this looks like my bathroom. Not that it's messy, just never mind. Um, all right, Chip, have fun leaving. You know. Oh yeah, I'm supposed to be videotaping for evidence. Bzz. Here we have a lovely family room. It's a sitting room, complete with a fireplace and a back door for quick evacuations if some scary monster comes through. Not that there's any on the land at all, especially not on the acres that you're going to be living on. Maybe next door, but. Uh, not at liberty to talk about those details. Dark hide and seek. You got it, Mama Nook. I'm back. Is that a tree house? I want to explore. <laughs> Dang it. Let me in. Let me in. Not by the hair of my skinny, skinny man. Because of Slindy. You know. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Peter. Peter. And my Patrick Warburton is way off tonight. My, my voice is kind of shot. I haven't been practicing my voices lately. It's not good. I need to keep my, my voice in shape. Yay. That's terrifying. <laughs> okay. All the children die with Uncle Sam. <laughs> That's a metaphor. Okay. Uh, barrel, 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 Daryl, Daryl. Hey, crank, <laughs> crank. You said shaft. Go to the cellar. There was a cellar. I missed it. Find a lantern, so you can see. I would love to, but I don't know where the cellar is. Is there a cellar connected to the house? Did I miss something? Do, 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 do. I'll do another sweep real quick. Because I, I don't like missing things. But I thought I was pretty on it. On it like Earthbound. For those of you who get that joke, I love you. For those of you who don't, I still love you. <laughs> Decode that one. You didn't miss it? Okay, I gotcha. It is coming. But win. Oh boy. Is there something in this little this little hidey hole? Nope. I mean look at the lighting effects. Like that's really beautiful. Is this um Oh uh, man. I lost it. I lost the engine name that I'm looking for. And not the not the racist Native American name, but the uh the game engine. And I meant that completely as a joke. Generators out of fuel. Well, fantastic. Well, this is dark. All wheat and barley should be stored in the subterranean cellar for cold store. Wheat can be stored up to nine months pending moisture. Dry grain should be taken to the cellar. Okay, I get it. There's a cellar. I'm going to press backward, and I'm not going to go back in there. <laughs> nope, not for now. 
I'm gonna look around real quick just to see. Do you hear what I hear? A creep, a cream, a slinking around my feet. Cold rain might turn into sleet. Cold rain might turn into sleet. Okay. I don't know if I should go and explore that uh that creepy noise. It's usually it's usually my jam to go explore things, but I also like to go explore things when I'm equipped to do so, like with, you know, a flashlight or a lantern or something of the sort. God dang. Okay, there's a windmill, there's a gate, I feel lost, <laughs> I feel super lost, and the head bobbing's messing with me, real bad, is this locked? <laughs> the gate appears to be locked with some kind of locking device, I don't know, maybe, doesn't make any sense, it's a mystery magic lock. And I did see the path leading out that other way. I'm just checking back here for uh, anything. I mean, this game doesn't seem to hide things way out in the open, especially in the daytime. So it's probably fruitless to be out here. Follow the trail. Yeah, I figured. I figured. I just like looking. I like searching every nook and cranny. That's why I, I do the things I do. I thought that signpost was a person. That kind of freaked me out. Out of the corner of my eye. See, I'm scaring myself more than the game is. <laughs> That's my noises for the the windmill. <gasps> it's the cellar. What's that? I see another door. Peppermint! Hey! Hey. Hey. Hey guys. How you doing? You excited about your Disney trip? Okay, this is creepy. I'll give him that. Okay, so the lights just kind of flicker on and off. This is, okay, so this is creepy. This is actually creepy. Peppermint, I've been playing this game for you. You just now showed up. How dare you. Ugh. <laughs> Cranny Rikers. No, it's Granny. Big book of stories. Oh man, I was wanting to read a story. I love stories. I love story time. Oh god, that was creepy. That was good. Scary stuff is gonna happen. Prepare your butts for the scary nuts. Gas. Thump. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep my eyes down because I know Slender. Ho! Oh. Do I go or do I not go? Do I stay or do I go now? I guess I'll go. Oh, that person's down there now. I guess I'll go back here first. Yeah, I'm, I'm guessing that I have to collect multiple gas canisters, though, for the for the generator. I don't know. Do I just get two? I'll look around a little bit. It's not Slender. Yeah, but Slender can still follow me, right? Did I explore everything already? Really? It doesn't feel like it. It feels like this place is a little bit bigger. It's a chick. Yeah, she was the chick that was uh, the mom that was crying earlier, right? She was in the burnt house. Okay, yeah. I guess I have... I've seen everything. Really? 
I don't like the little chair. I don't want to look at the chair. I don't want to look at the chair. <laughs> I don't want to see anything appear in that chair. I'll pass on that. So I guess we're out. Like, I, I made a complete circle. I mean... I don't know. I found two gas canisters. Maybe if I go in this end... I don't know. I don't know. Ow. Yeah, I mean, we were over here. We did this already. Just doing a double check. Just doing a double over, because that's what I do. I just like to make sure. Hello? Yeah, stay away from the tiny chair. You got that right. Freaks me out. Not okay with it. Especially tiny rocking chairs. But tiny rocking chairs, you can at least, like... You can give a reason. Yeah, I've, I've made a complete circle. Um, you can give a reason for why they move. You know, there's like wind or something, but... Nope, not the tiny chair. Good, I'll pass. That's the scariest thing in the game so far, is that tiny chair. <laughs> Alright, let's get out of here. I felt like a haunted house. That was fun. Huh, huh, Oh my god, it's a Doug 2 0. <laughs> The very rare evolution of Diglett. Oh, never mind. It's a silo. Or it's, never mind. It wouldn't be Doug 2 0. It'd be Doug Duo. Why did I say 2 0? Probably because I was thinking about Banjo and they do Banjo Tooie. Oh well. It was very dark. Oh, that was a thing. I didn't know if that was a thing or not, but it was a thing. It was absolutely a thing. You guys leave for Disney, so I know when I can break in. <laughs> Only Slender. Guess I have to go on the other side to get that note and that drawing. I don't like things I can't see through, I guess. You know, like, I don't like water that I can't see through. So, like, the edge of that circle, like, freaks me out to go into. But once I'm in it, it's fine. It's just, like, the thought of, like, staring into it, like, peering into the darkness actually freaks me out. A picnic! My friend didn't make it this far, so I don't know how anything past this. Oh, okay, right on. Well, cool. Welcome to the rest of the game. Uh, let's see if these names mean anything to us. Not really. Oh, I hit escape again. Why does escape take you to the main menu? Oh, okay, just paused it. Okay, thank God. Last time I accidentally hit escape, it took me to the main menu. Anything on the shack? That farm and shack is a little old place where you can plant some veggies. That's a key. Farm Shack Baby. Farm Shack Baby. I hope you guys have fun at uh, Disney. That sounds like a ton of fun. Like a ton of fun. It's pretty cool. 
So do I have to go back through? Is there an another way out up here? Is there something else? I mean, I got a key, so I guess I go back and I open the gate. So I guess we'll just do that. Unlock the gate. I'm going. I'm going. I'm on it. Creaky, creaky, creaky. Creepy creakies. Ooh, ha, 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 ha. Out. I'm out like sauerkraut. How'd the con go? Con Congo was was good. Uh, I think tomorrow Snips and I are gonna sit down and do a, a hats off all about the the uh, the expo or the con, whatever. I, I've been calling it a con for months, and then it was like, no, it's the artist and comic book expo, and I was like, oh yes. Marathon runner achievement. Okay, well, apparently I've been running a lot. Okay, well that happened. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Quink, 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 quink. Graves, a church, a steeple. Open the doors and see all those wiggling wangs. All right, where is the? Okay, cool. Haru. <laughs> I don't like the music. <laughs> Sorry, I thought the music was kind of cool through that area. Is that another headstone? Yeah, it's just another headstone. That's a good metal band name. Just another headstone. <laughs> okay, maybe like a high school rock band. I don't like the circle of stones. I'm not into that. That's That's old school, like, old world magic. Magic and demons come out of circles made of rocks and salt. <sighs> Sanctuary! I seek only salvation for myself and my family from that demon sent to torment my life. I bought the devil's wrath upon my family. I did this. I went searching for this demon. I brought him into our lives. I invoked his arrival. Could I have been so blind as to manifest such evil? Why could I not let old legends die? I alone should bear this burden. Why must my grandchildren suffer for my imprudence? They will never come home. That arch fiend has them now. Wait, his grandchildren? We all must bear this burden. We must all repent. Pen for our ignorance and rid this world of this demon for good. None ever shall confront this evil ever again. It dies with us. May the fire cleanse our souls and burn our sins. Frederick Matheson. Cool. Well, that's, that's the man. That's the man that brought the evil upon us. Just another headstone is something my old... Whoa! I was reading chat, so that kind of freaked me out, because I saw it out of the corner of my eye. Waking Up Dead was his old one. Oh man, Waking Up Dead's good. I like that. I think I'm going to play Hide and Seek in Dark. You really need to do voice acting? I'm getting into voice acting. Thank you, Liberia. That made me... That makes me all warm and fuzzy when people say things like that without knowing. Walter Matheson. May the angels guide you home. Yeah, I'm actually doing some voice acting for... I've done voice acting, actually, for a YouTube video. Can somebody pull that up? The Scarlet King? I'm sure you can just... You can Google that, too. The Scarlet King. The doors are locked. What hath I missed? What is it that I have missed upon this day? Hit the thing. Open. Yeah, Mamba knows. Oh, hi. 
Oh, good. Yeah, I'll just, uh, I'll take these toys, because that's not creepy. Okay, I'll admit, that got me. Just because I didn't know what the hell was happening. They got me. Good job, game. You finally scared me. Oh, okay, here we go. You should read books, but in the voices you expect they sound like and seek the audio. Like an audiobook. Yeah, um, I've actually put the doll in the tiny chair. No, then they'll become like the ultimate darkness. You can't you can't put the two powers together. It, they don't cancel each other's out, they only grow stronger. <laughs> Thanks, Mamba. I'm assuming that's the Scarlet King. Uh, yeah, I've actually, I've tried, I've auditioned for, uh, an audiobook before. I've only done one. I should do more. Okay. If you go to my channel, I've actually got, why am I explaining this Why I'm running from a demon? Uh, I've actually got a, I kind of want to look behind me. Is it coming for me still? I've got a series called The Long Dark where I um, kind of narrate the series. It's not exactly an audiobook type of deal, but it is, uh, it's me voice acting, essentially. So, if you want to go check that out, that'd be awesome. Seems to be pretty popular. People like it a lot. Can I close the door? I can't close the door. Should I keep running? I feel like I should look around. The whole game has been teaching me to look in every nook and cranny. And uh, now... And now it's telling me to slow down. Or it's telling me to speed up. Whoa, what's that? That's awesome. Bursenfloon. Burstflife. Burst Burstfifoon. Bifoon Kaka. Escaronuel voiced it. It's, he's immensely talented, but not that well known yet. Hopefully that changes and he can do it full time. Mamba. And I knew there was a reason I loved you. Dearie Diary. Patricia still has yet to come home. Mother insists she ran off to search for wildflowers again. I know it's not true. It was, it was that man that, that thing grandmother keeps ranting on about. I, I do not think she's mad. I have seen the man myself. He watches us as we play. Patty went to him. I just know it. If only Mother would listen. I wonder when she'll come home. Rose. Rosebud. But it's more or less the same as it's always been maybe tomorrow. What? Father's making us pray again tonight. It'll do no good. It's bothersome of anything. And I bet anything Patty and Walt ran away from this miserable old place. And I don't blame them one bit. Grandmother and Rose insist on some... Mm, baddie? Baddie take on... Take that strange man. What in the fatty? Fatty tail? Fatty tail. That a strange man took them away. Am I the only one keeping their wits around here? Maybe I should run away too, Maggie. That was awfully said and read. Um, I'll subscribe later. Is it the same name as the stream name? Yep, you got it. Liberia. Liberia. Uh, if that's what you mean. Dearest Freda, Frida, Frida, though my heart still pains for your missing children, I fear for your health, my sweet sister. You mustn't worry your mind with those twisted tales of our youth. You know as well as I that they were merely tales to keep us in good behavior. If only Mother knew what those silly legends would do to you. Though I have no recollection of the one you mention, was it from one of Mother's books you told with you? She, you took with you, took with you. My God, I can't read. I wish I were with you now in your time of need rather than whittling my days along, away alone. I wish you well, an ocean away. May my thoughts and prayers reach you. Okay. My reading's getting more dramatic and my ability to read is getting more problematic. Oh, God! Okay. 
Hey, what's going on? I know you're very, very, very angry because I took your toys or whatever. I think I missed a note right there at the end, too. Oh, the camera dropped. I thought it got me. I was like, what the hell? Do people that play this even know what VHS is even anymore? That thing? That ancient piece of technology? Oh, do we have another one? Okay. You were done. Is this Kate? Oh boy. Oh, this is kind of cool. Going back to the beginning. To the what's. Can't let him in. Can't let him in. Gotta close all the windows and doors. Can't let him in. Okay, that's already closed. That's already closed too. Do I just need to go downstairs? Yep, close, close, closed. I noticed that the words that were underlined were like, oh god, were uh, words like you a lot. It was just more about like you and, and this and that. Oh god, close that door. Okay, there we go. I closed the door. Um. <laughs> awesome. I love it. Whoa! Okay, hey there, friend. I guess I have to hide in my room. There's no point. He's already inside. Oh, wow. Okay. I wonder if you can actually stop him or not. I gotta hide in my room! Oh, my. He's right behind you. This is a cool story. I don't know. I would have been way into this if I was, like, 13. 12 or 13, I think. It's still neat. It's still an interesting story. I will say that. I'm glad that the story actually developed into something. I wish the front end had a little bit more direction on like who you were and why you were here instead of just like a car stopped. But uh, other than that, you know, it, it's it's all right. Just the front front end of it wasn't I wasn't crazy about. Number 12. I think I missed number 9. The house had to go. It can't save me anymore. Boom. Weird. It's like written on the side of the mountain. Is there something down there then? That draws my curiosity. The beginning. Oh my. I don't see anything down there. It just kind of circles back around, it looks like. Oh, get up there. Can I get up here? Oh, I guess I have to go down. I figured, like, I was just working my way to that tower, because I've been looking at it since the beginning. Who wants to get a job... Drawing Disney characters at Disney? Do it! That'd be awesome. Yeah, just just keep making art. Okay, I mean, I just walked in a circle. What's the... Actually, Fu, if you want, like, an inspiring tale, you should talk to Snips about this weekend. And how her art stuff went. Getting a portfolio together and going to a con is uh, really awesome. What the hell do you want me to do? What am I doing here? Oh, sorry guys. I'm back. I'm back. 
bothering me really bad today. Whew. Okay. I've always been able to walk on the grass, right? But I'm like juddering. Yeah, I'm having like glitch myself up that hill. I don't know. The only new thing in the area is this painting. Can I go down that way? Is this an arrow? Nope, just a mark on the ground. Yeah, I can't go that way. <sighs> this don't make no sense. I just came up from this way. And there was nothing. Oh, I mean, there was a note, I guess. I guess the note is what I was supposed to get and then come back down. I don't know. The most, like, lead-footed person I've ever met in my life. Okay, yep, can't go that way. Can you see it? Yes, I understand. The, the tower. I tried. I tried going to the tower. The tower didn't want me. The hill said no, no, no. That's where I found the note. And then there's a path across to the thing painted on the wall. And then this all circles back together into a nice neat bow leading me up to the thing where there's nowhere to go. I don't, I, I, I just don't. Are you supposed to glitch yourself up this hill? You have to glitch yourself up the hill. Is this, this can't be right. Do they make people do this? Oh my gosh, really? I don't, I just don't. What am I missing here, guys? <laughs> somebody, somebody give me a clue. What am I missing here? I feel like I'm supposed to get up there, but I just can't. Beginning, I don't understand. Uh, beginning, beginning, beginning. I, I mean, like, in the beginning, I saw him up there by the tower. In the beginning, I was back at the house, which I've already looked out over the mountains and I'm not seeing anything new. Beginning. I don't know. Do I just need to look at this for a while? Think about it? Hmm. I, uh, I don't know. Anybody? Bueller? Bueller? Oh, how did I miss that? How did I freaking miss a mine shaft? Oh my gosh, okay. Historic Colvin Mines, established in 1895. Closed in 1981, or something like that. There we go. Back to Creepfest. Creepfest 2015? Ow. Ow. God, what are my boots made of? 
They're absolutely not made for walking, that's for damn sure. Meet me by the street in an hour. I left a list of things to bring with you. Leave everything else behind. I'll explain everything as soon as I see you. I know how to fix all of this. Don't tell Lauren about me. CR. Is CR the car? Like, <laughs> I remember back in the day that the car and I used to go out exploring in the forest. Is anybody out there? Does anybody care? <laughs> Is anybody out there? I get that song stuck in my head all the time. Like, way too much. Does the Joker live here? Come on, Batman! Is this, uh... I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry for everything. This isn't your fault. It is. By the time you read this, it's already too late for you. Don't let him into any more lives. This is all my fault. This can end with you. I let him in. Why did I ever let him in? I'm sorry for placing this burden on you. I wish it was all on me. This can't spread any further. Please, it has to end with you. I wish there was some other way. It has to end. God, forgive me. Uh, no. About him. He knows about you. So, Slender Man Santa. Because he knows when you're sleeping. He knows when you're awake. He knows if you've been bad or good. Oh my god, what the fuck? Why is it all red? Fire! Holy... What in the... Whoa, I saw him. Goodness gracious, great trees of fire. That's a path. I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I guess away from Slendy. Oh, I see the tower. Am I supposed to be heading to the tower? The tower that I almost got to without going through the mines and the crazy fire, forest fire? I know words. Ow! This is a volcano or something? Just came out of the ground. Ah! Why? Why? Why is that happening? I don't know where he's at, but apparently I was looking at him. Oh, oh my. Oh my. Oh my. Oh my. What's happening? I can't see... He's coming. He's coming for us. Oh, am I supposed to go in there? Hey, let's go in there. Flashlight. You nailed it, Mamba. You nailed it. Emergency public warning system, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I don't know why picking up signs is important that have nothing to do with the, the story. Somebody's speaking whale. And cat, apparently. Unlocked the door. Including Star Wars Episode 1. Great way to get stabbed. It's a great way to make friends, too. It's the way I met you guys. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess, uh. Who's the other guy that hasn't been around for a while? Hehehehe. <laughs> <laughs> It's okay, guys. I speak demon. Let me in. This one following me in the... Okay, I'm good. I failed you. Oh, no, it's our friend! My friend.
Well, that's unfortunate. I did pick up his camera. That's how it, it started, that, that audio thing. How long is this game? My god. I like how it's willing to kill my friend, but not me, apparently. Oh, hi. Okay, that's weird. This is pretty exciting, isn't it? The whole mystery, the missing boy, the sightings, the arson. I'm glad I get to share this adventure with you. I can't help but feel saddened for Mr. Matheson. He lost so much. I wish he would have just let me in to help him the way you're helping me. Maybe I could have saved him. Since I couldn't help him in life, maybe I can help him now. I promise to find out what happened to his son. Perhaps that will put his soul at peace. Thanks again, Kate. I look forward to our adventures. Creepy. Hello, Derek the Mage. I was just wondering when you do your streams. I decided to check, so here I am. How you doing? Yeah, we. Uh, I stream on Tuesdays. Ah, okay. <laughs> I stream on Tuesdays and Thursdays, uh, and then randomly throughout the week, usually. Um, but are you gonna move? Okay, I'll go this way then. Um. This guy keeps stopping by my house asking about my son. I keep telling him to go away. He's getting more and more desperate. I still see him. I keep looking for him. It can't be him, though. I know it can't, but it's so real. Everywhere I go, I hear his voice, but it sounds like he's suffering. Like it's not the son I knew. I can't escape this torment, this man, this thing. He taunts me. He eats at my mind. Am I doing this to myself? Was it my fault Charlie disappeared? Is this my trial or my punishment? I need to end it. I need to cleanse this place. No more suffering. No one deserves this. It all ends here. It all needs to go. <laughs> oh, you're crying. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to laugh at your misfortune. I was just watching your Titan Soul first video, and I love it. I'm doing great. Oh, awesome. Well, thanks for uh, thanks for heading over and, and checking out the stream. I appreciate it, man. Um, can I ask how you learned about the channel and about Nook and Cranny Gaming? Oh. <laughs> Am I dead, dead? Oh, no. Is that the real end? Or, I, I don't know. I don't know what's going on anymore. Oh. Okay. That's Slender. The Arrival. That happened. <laughs> it's about all I can say is that happened. Um, oh, cool, Derek. I was just wondering. I did a, um, I did an expo this past weekend, and I met a lot of new people there. So I was just wondering if you were one of the people I met. But uh, awesome. I'm glad you found me through uh, through Beetle. Jay is an awesome guy. I like him. He's a cool dude, and I'm glad he uh, helped you find me. Yeah, and I'm glad you were enjoying the uh, Titan, the Titan Souls playthrough. It's 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 a long one because I was streaming it, and then I I put the stream on YouTube, which is the same thing I'm gonna do here. Anyway, let me get back to this. Um, and I'm not doing the YMCA. Th these are my hands up in the air because I don't know what to think. I um, yeah, exactly. <laughs> Derek, you just summed it up all together. Dot 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 cool game 
Uh, I don't know. The front part of it was boring. The middle part got exciting when I was in the tunnels with the dude that, like, chases after him. And other than that, it was okay. Thrasher1839, thank you for following. Appreciate it. Uh, I stream on Tuesdays and Thursdays. Also, make sure to check out my YouTube channel. Thank you. Um, also, welcome to the Nook crew. I'm trying to get all my things straight here. But anyway, the, yeah, it's very interesting into the game. It was incredibly abrupt. I'm sure the thing is, here's the thing. I'm not up to date or very knowledgeable on like the internet's collection of creepypasta, um, which is where Slenderman kind of originated and a lot of these other monsters that were in here. The guy that was running around in the dam or in the, the, the it seemed like a dam. I don't know, the bunker thing. Um, and then some of the other things I'm pretty sure are actually... Uh, creepypasta stuff that I just don't know about. So they were trying to tie those in as um, as fun little... Uh, oh my gosh, I just can't get my, my thoughts straight tonight. Uh, you know, just fun little bits for people that know that stuff. So they're th if they're interested in that, they see that and they're like, oh my god, it's the thing. So uh, try out hardcore difficulty if you haven't already. I feel like if that was... I'm sure that was, like, easy mode, because it probably starts you out on easy. But I, I don't understand where the difficulty would come in, except for how long it takes you to die. Uh, Thrasher, it's the same it's the same as uh, my Twitch channel. So it's Nook and Cranny Game. And thanks for checking it out. I appreciate it. So, I don't know. Like, it, to raise the difficulty would just mean to make it easier for you to die which already wasn't like a big deal because the checkpoints you think it just kicked you? Eh, that's no fun um, because of the checkpoints were so close together that it really wasn't a big problem when you died I only died once and I don't know I don't know it, it just it didn't have enough intricacy I guess to it it was just kind of like I don't know. I don't know. It, it didn't. It didn't have a whole lot of story for me. It didn't. It didn't drive with story. It only drove. It only drove it with objective. You know, like there was that one area. This sums it up. The the whole game. The one area. The objective wasn't um, find Charlie, and it wasn't. It wasn't um, find your friend or anything that connects to the story. It just said explore the area. Make me explore the area by telling me why I want to explore the area. Why is my character here? Why am I interested in exploring the area? And that's kind of how the whole game felt for me. Anyway, um, I'm going to quit out of Slender. I am going to play a little bit more of something else in order to get Slender out of my head so I can sleep. Um, yeah, I know I wasn't very freaked out, but I get freaked out once I go to bed and I lay there and I stare in the dark room and I uh, start thinking about things. So i got to figure out something that's going to be fun and lighthearted to play that'd be easy to do and uh ooh, boss monster would be fun but i'm gonna save that i think let's do let's do some rogue legacy unfortunately i don't have an install but it only took like a minute so don't worry about it the siege game okay we could play siege besieged <laughs> the me medieval copter. Yeah, let's do that, actually. That sounds fun. Because I think there's been a, a big ol' update for it. 